Today, the leader of Belarus faced new widespread protests to force him out of power. Alexander Lukashenko has been described as Europe's last dictator. CBS's Chris Livesay is there. From a brutal crackdown to unbridled resistance. Ooh, God, dear. Protesters in Belarus taking to the streets by the tens of thousands, demanding President Alexander Lukashenko step down after elections they say were rigged. This after police brutality, several demonstrators have turned up dead and dozens missing, perhaps in prison, perhaps worse, says one protester. We have no idea how many men were murdered in prison, so I'm really afraid. President Lukashenko had tried to scare all of these people into staying home, but it's clearly backfired despite beating them, bludgeoning them, and even torturing them. Today, they've given up their fear and traded it in for anger and for courage. Despite riot police and a president of 26 years seen here carrying a rifle and wearing a bulletproof vest, who says he'll consider new elections over his dead body. The opposition leader, Svetlana Tikhanovskaya, has fled the country. Our people, uh, they will not accept our president anymore. We have changed. Will the protesters win? Yes, of course. I, I sh I'm sure that we will win. Well, protesters chanting, long live Belarus, and Lukashenko, go away. The president of 26 years clearly having lost legitimacy, at least in the eyes of these protesters. And the question remains, when will he see that, and how long will he cling to power? Jamie? We'll have to see. Chris, thank you.